right, I'm doing a review on Offzol Mint. This will be my first review, so be easy on me. Um, as far as cut and smell, it's very, very minty. It's like overpoweringly minty. The cut's kind of choppy, but not bad. I have yet to find a single stem in here. Let's see if I can't. Choppy, but once again, I have yet to find a single stem. Um, very, very minty. Just, it screams mint. It's like you went out into the yard and picked some fresh mint right out of the ground. Um, I kind of like mint. I just, I don't know about it being that overpowering. As far as flavor and smoke goes, I get some good clouds out of this, as you can see. Um, flavor. Uh, it tastes more like spearmint than mint. Um, or not spearmint, peppermint, I'm sorry. Uh, it's not as harsh as it smells. It tastes like a candy cane, really something to think about. It tastes more like a candy cane, so if you like candy cane, definitely think about picking up this flavor. I'll let you guys know about my setup. I know, I know, I should have done it first before I started in the rest of it. I've got a 10 inch Zen hookah, a little cheapy I got from Urban Hookah. Um, I've heard a lot of people say bad things about small hookahs, you know, that you don't get as good smoke out of them or whatever, but I've got pretty damn good smoke out of this little 10 incher. I've got two Three Kings coals on here, which are working pretty good for me, as you can see. Now I'm still relatively new to hookah, so I don't really like giving uh, number ratings. I mean, I've smoked some hookah hookah, and I've had some uh, other brands as well. But uh, this is the first off off flavor I've had, and it's not really dead on with what they're saying, but it is a mint. It is in the mint family. It's pretty good. Um, I actually prefer peppermint over mint. I've never mixed anything, so I don't know how it's going to mix. Um, really good. I like mint. There's peppermint, even. Um, if I had to give it a number rating, I'd say 7 out of 10 because it's not really like the best cut, like I said, but it is juicy as hell. You are gonna need a paper towel or a rag nearby if you mess with this stuff. Um, I do like peppermint, but it's not what it says on the package, it says mint. So, seven out of 10. Good smoke though, really good smoke. I've actually been smoking for about 35 minutes now, so uh, yeah, I'm still getting good smoke, still good flavor, haven't lost any flavor on it yet.